All right, what's up, guys? We have an unboxing that I cannot wait for because I've been waiting for this uh, for like it seems like six months. It might it maybe like four realistically, but a long time. Um, this has been out of stock forever, and back you know four or five six months ago, uh, the uh, you know the, they had promised a, a restock around this time so uh, I've really been just waiting and waiting I even had uh, some funds set aside for this um, didn't have all of it but uh, definitely had some to to pitch into it um, I ended up sizzling it because I just I, ha I had to get it I've been waiting this long so let's get right in please subscribe to the channel if you're not already look down there and make sure that you are please and my Instagram is duties underscore daggers. You can follow me over there too if you want. All right, we got a packing slip. Let me get that out of the way. <laughs> quiet carry. Oh yeah. This is my first quiet carry knife. Um, I have handled it before, but this is my first time ever purchasing a quiet carry knife. Uh, not because I don't like them. Um, I've been <laughs> I've been drooling over a few of their models for a while, including this one. But finally, finally I did it, and it is. Oh, <laughs> look at that, dude! Woo! Oh yeah, it's the nine, baby, the quiet carry nine. <laughs> Let's get it out. Oh, yes. Oh, gosh. Oh, it's so nice. Oh, oh yes. I'm so happy, dude. Warranty. All right. Oh, man. So I got to take a look at one of these a while back. Um, it was lent into the channel, and I fell in love with it. As soon as I handled it and got a feel for it, I saw that the fit and finish and quality of the build was impeccable. Just absolutely stunning quality here. Um, just butter smooth action perfect detent. This one feels exactly how the other one did. Perfectly centered. Um, and I really love the design. Um, I guess it's kind of a straight clip. Kind of, but it's really kind of a drop point. It's a lower tip, but with um, pretty good belly here. Um, and just the way they... The, the way this is built is just incredible. So let's go over it. We have um, a carbon fiber inlay. Um, they had a couple options for the carbon fiber. There were some more colorful ones, but I'm not a really big uh, colorful carbon fiber guy. I don't really like all the, the crazy colors. I kind of just like this plain one. And it looks really nice. Really nice. It has some depth to it. We have the four holes there, which is Quiet Carrier's kind of signature. It's almost like they're touch mark sort of thing um, and then we have this other half or third whatever it is of just plain textured titanium which is so nice it's like a knurling it's a very very fine pattern which I absolutely love there's fine milling all the way around here too you can see that well I don't know if you can see it in the, in the, uh, in the camera but the way this carbon fiber is set in here is so perfect. I love how they have just a thin band of titanium all the way around the border there. And then how they do the hardware, it's just it's just a post and it's completely flush. Excellent. The way they do the backspacer is completely flush. I love that. I love how they do the clip, how it just kind of... Uh, it goes around the back actually you can see it's it's fastened there 
And then we have this same kind of uh, knurled section on the other side as well, which is just stunning. The lock bar kind of has a little curly cue. Man, the way that they cut this out for the lock bar access is amazing. The plunge grind is really nice and tight. So look at all that room we have for sharpening from here all the way to here. Excellent. Really nice stone wash on the blade. Full flat grind. This is going to slice well. Thin blade stock. Just literally everything about this knife I love. Man, the ergos are fantastic. Uh, you are kind of, you know, you're forced into having your pointer finger in this notch, which some people have said they don't, they don't really like. But man, I'm fine with it because you can choke up above that if you want, pretty comfortably. Put your middle finger down in there, just like this. That's totally comfortable. Um, or back here, honestly, it feels really com. I mean, really comfortable back here, but you're a little farther away from the edge. But if you want to get closer, right up there, you're fine. Gosh, it looks good. And this is in Magna Cut. I think the last one I handled was 20CV. Uh, now they're in Magna Cut, so this will be nice and stainless. Just look at this. Just, there's something about the fit and finish of this knife that that makes it stand out. It's it's almost kind of hard to put my finger on. And I, I said the same thing uh, the first time I unboxed this in the last video, the last time I handled it. I was saying the same thing. It's like, something about it is just really nice. It, it's almost like... Uh, it's something about the stone wash finish. It almost seems like this was in the tumbler for a long time because all the edges are just kind of like melted over almost. I don't know. It's hard to explain. But excellent. Really excellent. Uh, it was pricey. It was pricey. Um, I, th I can't even remember how much it was. I think like three... 60 something like that um not cheap obviously but i mean totally deserved and uh, you know obviously i paid that much so i think it's 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 worthy of that much that price tag um this is just an incredible knife it really really is so um if you missed out on this recent drop um uh, don't worry, because they have announced that they're coming out with uh, another batch, a larger batch, um, this winter. So if you see this and you like what you see, don't worry. Um, there will be more, and you won't have to wait as long as I have had to wait, hopefully. This is just absolutely incredible. I love how they do the, the lock bar relief cutout on the inside, so there's nothing to snag up here when it's going in and, out, in and out of your pocket. So freaking smooth, man. And this detent is just perfect. Absolutely perfect. You just barely break it and it comes swinging out. You know, you can even tell a, a detent's good just by seeing it on video. You know, if you if you watch people deploy enough knives, you can tell if someone goes like this and they flick out a knife, you can tell it's got a good detent or not, usually. Very smooth. It's on uh yep, it's on bearings. We have internal oh wait, never mind, no. We don't have internal stops. Um stop pin right back there. Some deep uh, milling, milled out holes in there for weight relief. Pretty deep.
I absolutely love it. Absolutely love it. Yeah, amazing. Um, this is not something I'll be selling at probably ever, so um, I'm not going to have any problem doing a full cut test video with this. So uh, expect that uh, coming soon, next week. That's it, folks. Thanks for watching. I'm going to go uh, sit and enjoy this thing. Thanks for watching. Please like the video before you head out. I would appreciate it very much. And I'll see you soon. Alrighty. Adios.